Hello, quilty friends. Are you looking for a fast and fun project to work on? I fell in love recently with three yard quilts. Now they've been around for a long time. I'm sure you, many of you have made your very own three yard quilts. You may have made a bunch, but I wanted to support a friend of mine and make some quilts to donate to her charity. Um, it's actually the sister of my friend is supporting an orphanage in Africa and all of the children that live there will be getting a quilt. So we need a lot of quilts in a short amount of time. And I have seen these three yard quilts. They look like a lot of fun. I love pulling fabrics together. So I planned to dive in and I want to share that quilt, how it came together in just one day. So let me know what your favorite pattern is from our friends at Fabric Cafe who have a whole wide range of booklets called Three Yard Quilts. Okay, here we go. I've got my book, the Pretty Darn Quick Edition from Fabric Cafe. And I found this wonderful print. Won't that make a great focus fabric? It's Land of Enchantment by Sarah Diddy. And there's a coordinating red that is just beautiful with this. And I wanted a soft look with that to make the sugar pie quilt from this edition. And everything begins with cutting. And I'm cutting strips following the directions, and just getting that going. Let's watch in a really sped up version. Of course, I can't cut quite that fast, but everything in this pattern is strip sets, larger pieces to show off that focal print, and there was a pretty early decision that I had to make, and that was how am I going to frame this fabric? Do I want the red to be the initial frame and then the teal or reverse that and keep the teal real close to the focus fabric? And I think I like it better with the red. So let's go with that and get the rest of our cutting done. One thing you notice me doing here is I cut a large piece first and then I cut the smaller strips out of that large piece. So I mentally add up width that I need and then cut it down. I'm sewing at a retreat. So we each had a six foot table. You can see I've got all my stuff around and I am just working on the strip sets and then back to cutting so that you've got your smaller pieces and then these strip sets actually make the borders and sashing all within the single block so it really comes together quickly and it's a lot of fun.
sew the blocks together in rows, add some borders, and we are all done in one day. The sugar pie pattern from the Pretty Darn Quick Three Yard Quilts book was fabulous. So run out, grab three yards of fabric, and make yourself a new quilt this weekend. Enjoy! Looking for some projects with jelly roll strips? Here's my collection of favorite quilt blocks and favorite quilts to make with two and a half inch strips. Happy quilting!